Hey guys, it's Mike here. Uh, you got some infiltrator gameplay. I don't have the infiltrator mech anymore, so I'm going to be playing some assault and probably do another sharpshooter videos uh, again tomorrow. Apparently, the beta ends like tomorrow. It, it's extended until then, so I assume like at um, like midnight it'll go away. So I'm gonna I'm gonna pause everything. Well, not everything, but. Um, other stuff I was planning on doing just so I could get the last few minutes of, uh, sorry, the last few parts of videos I can of this out. Because I really like this game. I really want to show it off, so. Let's go play some Assault Mech, kids. Alright, and we're going to use F to go and get rid of the heat. So I'm going to tell, so we're playing Missile of Command here, which is like, uh, it's basically, uh, a capture point defense map and there's a couple things I've learned that I want to tell you guys uh, about because I think I think it's important and I and one of the things I've learned is that I should still need to learn how to equip my weapon because seriously I, every single time I had that that damaging gun all right this guy's so dead and so am I probably oh yeah there you go oh it's only assist I'm sad all right, what kind of unlocks do I have with this? Oh yeah, I have that bubble shield. So, um, so Missile Command is basically a, a capture point map as you would probably expect. It is very simplistic. Um, there's really not much to say about it. It's just, uh, so these silos attack the enemy base occasionally. All right, I don't like this guy. I have, I have a feeling getting sniped. That guy is sniping me. Ooh, that guy got hit right in the torso. You know, but it, you maybe shouldn't stand still. It makes me a really easy target. Oh, here we go. Okay. I'm putting I'm putting this in here, and then let's go get him. Finish him. There we go. Um, so some of the things that I wanted to tell you that I've learned. So, one of the things you did notice me talk about was, um, I was trying to jetpack up on top of things. Oh, my bolt shield. Okay, we lost another silo. Let's go get that one from behind. This Mike always says it from behind. Oh, shit, wait. Out here. Alright, I used one of my grenades. Unfortunately, one of those guys is, uh... Oh crap. You will have to come to me. And we'll try and duck over here and heal. Maybe you won't see me. Um, you, the max, there's actually a max height limit, but not in the sense of map limits. It's actually based upon where you stand. You don't hit an artificial limit on your map. It's just kind of you instead, um, you can jetpack up a certain distance and then you reach the limit. Yeah, you got your back, bro. No. Okay, where's this guy? I think I'm being attacked by somewhere, but... Oh, God. Alright. Let's go and put a bubble shield up. Oh. Nope, that didn't work. Well, that was good life. So there, there is actually like it's basically when you notice me jetpacking up, you can depending upon where you start, it remembers where you start, and then that's that's your maximum height. So if I go up here, it goes up a certain distance, and then it tells me I'm at my max height, and that's how that works. So it's not like a map limit, like they're trying to prevent you from leaving the map. It sort of is, but you know, uh, I don't, actually I don't know if this is the better one. Oh shoot, ran out jetpack. Okay, we appear to be losing a lot of silos, but luckily my team is making up for that. Oh, damn it. Well, that did not work too well. I guess I'll have to go hang out over here. I see a guy down there, though. There we go. We're in, shape. We're in good shape now. You get, to, you get some machine gun action in. Oh yeah, so yeah, it's it's based upon kind of like a max height, so that's it's that's kind of interesting, I guess. Oh damn it, he was onto me. 
So it's not like they, yeah, as I said, it's not like they're preventing you from leaving the map. We lost the silo. That ain't good. We'll go over here. I, I'm using a bubble shield cap to protect myself, although that guy didn't chase me. The second thing is, I was complaining a lot about the currency systems, and um, it, it was not necessary. I didn't need to complain about that. Oops. Oh, I fell off. Let's go. Let's go up and flank him. This guy's the fucking the, the sharpshooter, I think. What's Francis? Yep, so that's what it's like to face a sharpshooter. You can kind of see his uh, weapons firing all at once. Uh, and I also see an engagement going on here. I think I disabled someone. I think I may have saved this guy. If I didn't, then I apologize. So, um, the currency system I was complaining about, sort of complaining, I was kind of like, well, I know they'll fix it. But I didn't actually know that the beta ends tomorrow, like, it ends really fast. So, um, and that, that, that keys into it, because that means they didn't put a whole lot of effort into balancing that to begin with, because they're like, well, fuck it. We'll just give them a bunch of money. Oh, crap. Fortunately, it looks like I'm being attacked. Oh crap. Okay, never mind. Submachine gun got me. Let me see, which one's the more accurate one? Probably should have this one. Fire. Yeah, this one I probably want. I like accuracy. So it's really not worth complaining about the currency system when it's like, yeah, it's like it's like a couple days. There's no way I was gonna get experience. Nobody's gonna get experience for that in the first place. They're just getting feedback, so you know, you guys have even less of a reason to complain. So the next time I'll be playing this, um, beyond uh, the next sharpshooter video is pretty much going to be in uh, when the open beta starts for everybody. Everybody can play at that point and it's going to be uh... there we go. We got that guy. So it's 12, 12, 12 is December and all that kind of crap like December 12 uh, <laughs> you know year 2012 and then all that kind of crap. We're going to get no more dates like that in 2013. That's rather sad. So this is the last Last 12, 12, 12 kind of date we could possibly have. Alright. Oh, got that guy. There we go, another one down. We are protecting this like bosses. So this is kind of interesting game mode, as I said. I, I'm, I, I like the team deathmatch mode, but I like this even more because it's like... There's actually a bit of strategy to it. We got this guy. All right, let's go. This is this also makes a great little place to kind of defend. Uh oh. All right. Luckily, I got that off. That's what I thought, buddy. No more EMP missile for you. That bubble shield is actually pretty useful. I will say that that may have saved me there, or at least saved me a lot of health. I'm gonna just steal out of the open like a boss, because I just have like to touch up. So, you know what, overall, it was a great uh, closed uh, closed beta. Uh, it really showed off what uh, the, where they're heading with us, so it's it's quite nice. And the game modes are, are nice and tested now, I suppose. And I didn't get to play much uh, more, uh-oh. Oh, fuck, okay, that was, that was it for me. I was done for. You know, I got to try a bit of Infiltrator, even though I couldn't buy a whole lot. I kind of wish that I knew from the beginning, because then I would have bought the Rocketeer, made some videos on that, but I only have these two classes. Let's go do this, basically. <laughs> Should have probably given us more money. So, our base is the one in the top left, so we obviously have a lot more health, and they're losing health on theirs, so... Let it... Let's go and, uh... Piss them off. I love range, man. Even when it comes to like things like this, it's it's still really nice. Okay. Oh. You 
they're down. Wow, these guys, wow, they're gonna get triple kill or something. What? Yeah. Oh, damn it. You ruined my find finest moment. I was gonna kill three mechs at once. Oh, wait, we need to go take this back. Let's go stand near this. Sorry, I shouldn't have fucked off quite as of yet. Alright. Let's be ready for anything. I, you know, I think, as I said, Ruck tier, nice mech, um, but Sharpshooter Assault, my two favorites. One, for, this one for speed, the Sharpshooter for accuracy. You know, the, the, but the thing is, the Sharpshooter might actually get nerfed because it's like a sniping mech in a, in a game where uh, it's a hologram. Oh, uh, let's go actually over here. Attack! Oh wait, that's not quite where I expect to be. I wish I could melee him. Uh, that really doesn't make any sense in a game like this. It's, I, I love the I love the atmosphere still. It's just you know you can hear the sounds. The graphics are just freaking insane. Let's go get this guy. Oh, I'm, I have little fuel, and I probably shouldn't have done this. Ow. Alright, let's go. Let's do this totally sweet jump thing. Oh, you don't make it all the way up there. I thought you did. So I can I can go uh oh. Oh, we won. It doesn't matter. Hooray! And the base pulls up the base. The base pulls up the base. That's cool. So you know, if you say that you know they're not doing they're not doing creative game modes, well, you're wrong because it's. I think this is creative. I, I like this. This is kind of nice. You know, you get a nice little. Uh, oh, cool! Let's look at some stats. Well, it's 40 seconds to go to the next place. So unfortunately, I did not get. I got one multi kill. Best multi kill was one. Oh, yeah. Here you go. This is the thing. So everything here goes for experience. So how well you do goes for upgrading experience. And match win time and ma and the pl your placement also matters towards the points, but it just barely gives you anything, as as I was complaining about before. But I, I, if, it, if the experience mattered, then it would be like, oh, I have my my new mech in like five games. But at this rate, it'd be like you know, hundred bez and said it's not worth not even a hundred. If I had a hundred games like this, I wouldn't even have enough for that for that mech. It would be sixty sixty five hundred, you know, and they they cost like nine thousand. So, you know, I, that as I said, that part I still think is ridiculous, but. Uh, as I just said, it's closed beta, so they're, I, I have no doubt in my mind that they're gonna, they're gonna fine tune that. Although I kinda like the, the experience seeing a big number, cause, you know, when I see big numbers, I, I get happy. Numbers are fun. Reminds me of the tribes, uh, okay, we're ready to go. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna still rock, uh, rock some, some assault. As I said, I was gonna do two, two, two good games of this and split it up however um a lot of you like the fact uh well at least one person has said they, they like the fact i'm actually doing a multiplayer commentary without other voices which is you know uh, it's not that I, I i don't want to play with other people it's it's just like this time i kind of felt like well you know um there's only like two people i know who are in this hockey beta and they're not clearly the people i would potentially record with so i, I tried something new and, and and also i've been kind of getting sick of all the co-ops i've been doing lately and I kind of just want to hang out with you guys and just, you know, you know, because it is easier to do a co-op because I could talk with somebody rather than just you and having to make up my own words. So. Alright. Nope, I missed that completely. Oh, I... We should be able to get this anyways. I think everything looks a little too metallic here, though. I think that would be a complaint of mine. Well, it looks like all the fights are going on somewhere else. There we go. This seems to be aiming for something. Oh, come on, come on, you're almost dead. Oh, yes! Jetpacks forever. I love jetpacks. And, like, his corpse now goes beside me and sets on fire and shit. They're gonna need to have some graphic effects because I don't know if I want to see the film grain all, all the time. Alright. 
Wow, we are holding all three again. All of a sudden. Alright. I think what I'll do is now I'll be a little pissant and just uh, get in spawn camp. No, I don't know. Oh, wait, we, maybe I can. Nope, you missed, pal. Oh, you don't get to run. Fish. It's not the way it works. You can play with my... It's not really spawn camping. It's spawned a little bit farther than this. Oh, but they're taking that. So this, you know, if this was spawn camping, this was a miserable failure to begin with. All right. No. We cannot allow them to get a foothold. Get these sand rakers off our world. Hey, Amen. All right. That's one down. Oh, we got this again. All of a sudden. Okay. It's just one guy got past us and like four of us come and respond. Okay, well, it looks like they're all leaving. We... Ooh, I can make it up here. Wait, wait. Oh. What? It said something requested. I didn't hear it. Now, they have a spotting system, I'm pretty sure. But I don't really know what it is. Alright, let's go. Let's go take over this thing. Because this will be a rather embarrassing. Okay, let me do bad manner repair. Uh oh. Dead <laughs> I, I didn't think I, I thought I was behind the shield fully. Oh well. It would have been more funny if you shot the shield. <laughs> Bad meta repair. <laughs> I just created something. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's still too. I, I, I'm gonna switch teams. I feel like a dick. Uh, except I don't really know how. Oh, it's a, we have a map. Uh, let's try to figure this out. Okay. No, I, uh, that's talking. Okay, um... I, I have no idea how to freaking do this. Okay, won't lie. I don't know what the team switching key is. Okay, yeah, I, I, I can't switch teams. Okay, never mind. Sorry. And we're gonna just have a... Oh, maybe they just don't let you do that. Oh, wait. No? Okay, well, someone switched or got, got on the team anyways. Never mind. No, no, please. Oh, fucking hell. Let's go over here. That's my job. My job is to be sneaky. Okay. Time to go repair. No more bad mana repairs for me. At least for the rest of the beta. Oh, do we have this actually? Uh, yes, uh, yes we do. Okay, it, it actually points I'm at it at three. The UI is really good. Like, it's really kind of refined. Whoa, okay, come on. Let me get in here. All right. Damn it. Uh, well, there's, there's a guy down here, I think. Nope, he's above me. Hey. Oh no, don't, don't use your flat cannon. Would that be like the shotgun mech? That'd be sick. Oh crap. Oh, he locked on. EMP. -E Dick. Now to bad manner repair. No, this isn't bad manner at all. This is good manner. I have to, I have to heal myself. It is, it is kind of my purpose. Yeah, these guys both have those Rocketeer mechs, they're kind of jelly. Ah, oh, I missed him. Damn it. Oh, frick. So, it gives me the incoming uh, sign whenever there's a missile coming. 
Okay, so I were I was on you there. Yeah, as long as he's stuck over there, I don't care. I am defending my choke point. Like a good mech should. Now I wonder, you know, I have a middle click. And it doesn't actually appear to actually do anything. It's kinda sad. Alright, so this guy is over here. I see him in the corner there. I'm gonna go for him. Should repair, buddy. Nope. That's it. Use it repairing. It's, well, that's, you know, regenerating health mechanic, etc. Call of Duty. Alright. Well, we need to go quickly over here and go and, uh... Get our damn silo back. I'm gonna see if I can lend a hand. Well, apparently I'm, no, I'm not needed at all. And we keep losing silos. I can't really see this game having a really big competitive community, because uh, it is meant to be like a mech simulator game. I mean, I don't know. And you know, some people were comparing it, well this is not as strategical, this is like a very... Very kind of like twitch aim kind of a mech, mech game. Uh oh. Yeah buddy, you're gonna have to help me out here. Oh, uh, I think I did a bit of damage myself there. Yeah, he must have like a kind of a shotgun ability because that that explains why. Like that, do you see that flag cannon that was kind of like spreading out? Kind of like that. That usually it's the video game shotgun logic. That is, by the way. Um, obviously, real shotguns don't work that way. But uh, but like it, you know, the whole the whole very close range spread. So he 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 has a lot of armor and is meant to kind of get into close range. That's my guess at, at least. Oh well. Okay, that guy's just kind of walking into the wall there, probably lagging out. Always fun. I like the bubble shield I have for protection. Nope, that's it, it's ours. It is our point, uh oh, maybe not. Nope, I have decided you are not allowed to, you are grounded for weapons, mister. <laughs> Terrible parent, mech parent. Although he, he's fatter than me. Clearly he is the parent, and I am but a child. Quick and nimble. I don't really know what I'm talking about anymore. So he's trying to snipe us. You can do that all you want, my friend. Well, this one's ours. I, I wonder how he got up there. I, I guess you can just jetpack up there? I don't know. Alright, let's go over here. Wait. Yeah, they're coming down here. Went on. All right, uh, we we are kind of in trouble here. Oh, flat cannon! That thing is really powerful. Okay, let's 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 do some really close range praying spray kind of stuff, shall we? We so graphic settings are. I think I'm playing on like high or something like that. So I get a bit of hiccups. But I'm, I think I'm running a bunch of shit in the background, but doesn't really help. So we'll, we'll try it. They really want Silo 3. Kind of like this thing, but I can't long range anything anymore. I, I, I would feel dirty for not going with anything but 100% HP. Let's do this. Oh, I think we won. Okay, I think that's uh, enough assault uh, mech uh, action for today, and I also got this uh, this interesting game mode in, which I you know I personally like it. It's it's fun. Um, you know, I think I think from the worst to best game types, it goes from my, my opinion siege, uh, deathmatch, team deathmatch, and then uh, this mode. Like I I'm, I think team deathmatch and this are kind of tied because both of them are team games and they're nice. Um, when you're playing deathmatch, it's very, it's very not serious because it's just like you know someone kills you after you kill someone else kind of thing. Like I'll rub your back, you rub mine kind of shit going on. 
so it's not really uh, high. It, it 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 can. I don't know if it, if you can call it frustrating, but it doesn't feel like there's a point. It's just mindless kind of thing. Ooh, my salt might upgrade it slightly. So that that's what that one's good for. And uh, as a you know, team deathmatch and and this are very good. This one's probably just slightly better for the spawning, but it's just the protecting of those points, which can be kind of dumb. Uh, and the and obviously the siege boat, although it's cool as for actually playing it, it's too much stalemate. So I think that's pretty much it. So that's all I have to talk about. Um, here, you know what? I'm gonna show you some of the settings actually, just briefly. So I can change like the cockpit color, uh, field of view, obviously to 90, and you have a whole bunch of keys. And video settings, yeah. Oh, I do have mine on ultra. Never mind. You probably shouldn't have it on ultra. And physics is off, obviously, because I have a, an ATI card, and that's it. So. That gives you a little bit of an idea of how uh, the beta is, because I know someone was asking for what some of these things do, and I got a bunch of friends lists and stuff, and that's pretty much it. So um, I'm ho I'm hoping that, that they actually increase the the text size a little bit. If there's not a yeah, there's no there's no setting for that here, because it's just on 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 my widescreen for YouTube. It's um, oops, don't do that. It's a little a little bit big, so uh, it's a little sorry, a little bit small. Sorry, it's a very tiny text, so. It's hard to read on YouTube. So I think that's it. So I will see you guys later. Bye.